Hello and welcome back to another video with me Mioni for Final Fantasy XIV. This time it's another data mined mount, courtesy of Icarus Twine of the data mining group over at the Final Fantasy XIV subreddit Discord community. A link will be in the description to his page, please go and support it for up to date data mined information on every patch. This then is a look at this new mount, the Red Hair Horn. This is available in our data files, but came out recently in China as a timed exclusive in part for their release of patch 4.2, they're exactly one patch behind us at current. We will likely get this in our own cash shop in the future at some point. If we look at the Chinese prop mall mog station page, you'll see that if we translate the money it goes for around £26.79p or US$35.67. Obviously that's just a direct conversion and we have no idea what it would actually cost when it will inevitably come over to the west, but it gives us a good idea. So we do actually have some in-game footage and some information courtesy of Icarus, so this is what it looks like. The item to summon the red hair is the red hair horn. This horn of bone emits a plagiant tone that summons the red hair, war steed of the great Ganon himself. Summon forth the red hair, legendary steed known for both its unmatchable speed and its fiery red coat. Ganon was known for his imposing presence on the battlefield, a trait that can partially be attributed to his mount, the red hair a lightning swift steed magic to stride the very heavens. This horse is said to be a direct descendant of the awe-inspiring stallion, probably. The hidden text reads, I spring across the battlefield with the swiftness of the rabbit, a quote there of Gaius I. So there you go, we had an in-game image or two before in a previous video, but this thing looks absolutely awesome in action, in my opinion. I like the flowing red horse armour, I'm just glad that we don't have to pay extra for horse armour in this game. But I do just hope at this point they're not too greedy with a price, and not some horrible promotion when it does inevitably come to the west. I'm expecting at least $25 or so to be in line with the other mounts on the store. As to when we might actually get this, I have no idea. But all this information, complete tooltip information, model and sounds were all added to our game in patch 4.3, so who knows. Either way, thank you to Icarus for his continued data mining work for both the community on Reddit and the greater community of Final Fantasy XIV. Check out those links below to support him. Thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you all next time.